Hello. <laughs> Having a little coffee here, and I thought I would share with you another skirt. This skirt is named Felicia. I named this skirt Felicia only because I was watching all of the Father Brown mystery series on Netflix. If you like British mysteries, especially lighthearted ones, Father Brown is for you. That's a lighthearted one. I'm currently watching all the Oh, I can't remember the guy's name. Foil. Foil's War or something like that. Great. Wonderfully done. Beautiful. But it's just slightly darker. But of course, World War II, it's, it's going to be a little darker. Anyway, this is about the skirts. So, this is my favorite coffee cup right now. Felicia. <clears throat> Felicia is a wrap skirt that I will not be putting on because uh, she does not fit me. Like, she'll go around me, but then, you, you know, you're getting quite a view. So, <laughs> I, I don't recommend her for um, anything above a 1X, approximately, so maybe 18, 20. So, I think I have her sized at a 4 to an 18, maybe. Um, this is one view. Here's another view. I decided to write down some specs on this skirt. This is only the second time I've done this. I'm still learning. So Felicia is... Oh, Lady Felicia is one of the characters in Father Brown. That's... Good lord. And this doesn't look like something she'd wear. I just like the name. Okay. So this skirt is 37 inches long. So it's a long skirt. And... The width at the very top for the skirt is 49 inches, but I have put darts in it in different places to make it, it's not an exact A-line, but it's just, it's a little more forgiving of your hips um, than some wrap skirts can be, because it's not on a bias. Um, so it goes out to 54. So right at the waist, it's 49 and then it slants out and I think it's about six inches below that is when it's um, 54 inches. I've got a long satin ribbon on either end uh, for wrapping her around and I can certainly trim that if you let me know that you would like it trimmed otherwise you can trim it it's not uh, I've, I've done it like this so it trims and looks wonderful. Uh, this is also lined with just a cotton muslin, um, only about halfway down. The exterior of the skirt, these quilt pieces, I did not quilt this skirt. Um, I didn't piece the skirt, I mean, because it's not quilted, it's just the top uh, pieced quilt that I found at a flea market several years ago. And uh, I have washed this skirt on cold using uh, dye-free, fragrance-free detergent um, and tumble dried it low in the dryer. I did that because I wasn't really sure how color fast the fabrics were going to be and also I didn't trust all the stitches because I didn't stitch them. <laughs> so, and I'm glad I did that because as it turned out this square right here with the pink and this sort of a brown and tan plaid. Um, if you can see, I have zigzagged, there's the camera f trying to focus, look at that. I've zigzagged it uh, because there were a few that had popped, a few of the seams had popped. So that's all now nice and secure and it's secured to the, um, to the lining. I don't know what else I can say about this. I've darted it in a few places. And I gave you the length. I will try to insert at the end a little uh, I don't even know what the word is for that. Ha ah, brain. Anyways, I have some really lovely pictures of the skirt on um, a good friend as well as on my mother-in-law and my grandmother-in-law. Uh, it looks so awesome on I love it on people. It looks amazing. Um, 
yeah, this is, Felicia is a fun skirt. There's also a skirt that I will probably do in my next video that is made from the same quilt top and therefore, and it's a wrap skirt, but it's got a slightly different, there's a couple things that are different about it. And uh, so the name is similar, it's Felicia Lynn. This is just Felicia though. So Felicia has the wide ribbon here and Felicia is uh, the bigger one of the two. The other one is slightly smaller in the waist because of the way I did that. Um, and so this has the, I'll give you all the different squares. So this one, you can see that it's kind of a rust color with this floral print and above that is the blue and the yellow. And then we have that pink and tan in the middle and below that is sort of an orange with, this is black and white. <laughs> and then this is a fun one, the green with the white. Look at all those colors there. And then below that is this, um, this is a red but it's kind of an orangey red. And then these are blue and white. Yeah, so this is Felicia, and as I said, hopefully following this little bit, there will be a slideshow, that's the word I was looking for, a slideshow of photographs of lovely women wearing this skirt, and all three of those women are different sizes and different heights, so you can kind of see uh, how it looks on those different women. Uh, if you liked the skirt, or this video, or both, please give me a thumbs up. And you can follow me on Instagram, I'm on Facebook, I have a website. I also have an email address if you would like to contact me about any of my skirts. That email address is real easy, it's lucindamarieskirts at gmail.com. And uh, the website is also easy, it's lucinda-marie.com. Uh, and there's all kinds of ways you can find me. I will put links to all of that below, as well as a link to the Etsy listing for this skirt in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. Have a beautiful day.